Hey guys, Mike Lomenz here from MyTennisTools.com. I've got a great tennis match here from the Atlanta Senior Invitational Category 2 Tennis Tournament held in May of 2018. It's the Men's 70 Doubles Final. Al Yearwood and John Chris seated number one versus Hugh Thompson and Jerry Thomas seated number two. But I think we all know how much these uh, seedings and these uh, rankings really mean, of the rankings particularly this early in the year. So we've got, that's Jerry Thomas on the far side serving, his partner is Hugh Thompson. Receiving serve right now is Al Yearwood. Up at the net on the right, his partner is John Christ. So talking a little bit about some biography. There's a whole bunch on, uh, on Hugh Thompson, if you look him up. He uh, started playing when he was seven years old uh, in Australia. And he's got 50 junior titles and 20 open titles. And I guess that's while he was in Australia, it doesn't say. Uh, he played college tennis at Mississippi State University where he had a 54-2 and record. He had three uh, singles titles and four doubles titles. He, for the past 45 years, he's just played numerous uh, national and international tournaments uh, representing the United States. Uh, over 20 times in a team competition. So, so Hugh Thompson's got quite the uh, background here. And uh, the rest of the players, I don't find that much. They do have uh, their rankings. By the way, Hugh Thompson is ranked number two, currently ranked number two in the men's team doubles, number nine in the individual doubles. I should say that was before this tournament. Jerry Thomas is from Rockwall, Rockwell, Texas. He's ranked number 13 nationally uh, in men's 70 doubles. And Number one in Mississippi, which, uh, you know, Mississippi's a tough market. He's ranked number one in the doubles. John Christ is from Bluffton, South Carolina. I don't have the rankings on him. I know that he and Yearwood are ranked uh, really high. Uh, maybe I'll find some uh, info on Jerry, Jerry Thomas a later on. Al Yearwood from Germantown, Tennessee. He's ranked number one nationally in the men's 70 doubles team. Number two in the men's 70 individual doubles. Uh, that number one ranking is probably the John Crest. So there's your rankings for what they're worth. But the proof is in the pudding here. Looks like we're gonna have a pretty competitive match here. This is Hugh Thompson serving here to the ad side. I have formation on the ad side. I like that. A little more on that later. I'll tell you why I like that. There's Al Yearwood serving here. John Chris, nice uh, backhand. Great post by Hugh Thompson. Swing the ball and miss it. Tied up two all. His hands, really. 
So I didn't have any information before on John Chris, but as of uh, the completion of this match, he did end up being ranked number one in the country. Uh, team doubles, along with uh, Al Yearwood. Oh, I don't know if it makes you feel any better. It makes me feel better to see the uh, number one teams. Miss the ball oh, once in a while, those easy ones. And again, that was a serve to the ad side doing the uh, I formation. And it's interesting that he served it up the middle to Al Yearwood's forehand. Let's see where he serves it this time. Ah, to the backhand, very good. Now, this is why I like it. He's forced to hit the ball back into the court so the server doesn't have to move so far. If you serve it to the forehand, the guy can hit it out wide and you have to cover more court. Nice coach, he just barely got away with that. Nice hand by Hugh Thompson, showing how he won all those titles. Tied up three all. Okay, so we're going high formation, sorts of wide. Has to get the ball back into the court. Less work for the server. At least that's my theory. Goes wide again. Force it to Two handed back now. In case you didn't notice that. Sometimes you slice or sometimes you hit that top spin back in. Up the tee. Oh, he was aiming. The uh, receiver there was trying to hit that. Good stuff. Wide again. Very good. That didn't work out that time. That was a great serve. Thompson and Thomas go ahead, four games to three. Big cover up the middle there. Stick right over and take that middle shot away. We will take some big shots here today.
got an advantage to that slow certain from getting close to the net. Good hand. Great point. That's why they're number one.
Ah, uh, there you have it. First set goes to Yearwood Christ, 6-4. Subscribe to the YouTube channel by clicking on the uh, subscribe button in the lower right-hand side. If you can, we will have lots more videos to come from this tournament. Uh, some of the 40s. Even got a 30s match. A 50s. Uh, 75 singles with Jimmy Parker. And uh, <clears throat> Red Drilling. Ball goes wide, Thompson and Thomas. Up two to one. If you ever get a chance to play this tournament, if you're a senior player, it's up here in Atlanta in the Buckhead area, Cherokee Town Country Club. Beautiful setting, great bunch of guys. They feed you lunch every day and they have a players party on Friday night. And it's just a lot of fun to hang around, play tennis, concentrate on your tennis and watch some of the nation's best players that always show up for this Atlanta tournament.
Well, guys, that wraps it up. Yearwood Crisp are the champions with a 6-4-7-5 win over Thompson and Thomas. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please subscribe to our channel and visit the website at mytennistools.com. You can maybe see how easy it is to make your own videos using the same equipment I just used. Stay tuned, subscribe to the channel, more videos to come. Thanks for watching.